It was a story about heroes helping heroes with a free lunch for children fighting cancer. 11 Alive photojournalist Kathy Bourne was there as large servings of love were handed out at Children's Health Care of Atlanta. <laughs> I'm Ginger Kindred. So many toys this year. My husband, Greg Kindred. Our oldest son is Taylor. And our youngest that went is a cancer survivor is Trenton. Good job, guys. And we were at Children's Health Care of Atlanta more than we were home for about a year and a half, two years. It just happens overnight. And your families are just devastated all of a sudden. Guys, your turkey's so good. We, we have people that are right now finishing up cooking, getting everything done, and they're going to start bringing stuff over that'll be hot. Thursday night meals are brought in every Thursday night at CHOA through Cure Childhood Cancer. And we always said, if we survive through this with Trenton, we want to get back. And so that's what we try to do, even if it's just for a couple of hours, is try to provide some normalcy, a break, a relief from everything that they're going through. So that's kind of how we came up with this. And Potatoes! Look at you. <laughs> it wasn't really about the food because you're not wanting to eat cafeteria food all the time. But it was about seeing the people from the outside that have either walked in your shoes before or just want to come in and help. And that's what's so great. These kids in our neighborhood, in the community, and through school, they want to help. Look how beautiful those are. And our children are doing something through Christmas Eve. It's not all about just them receiving, but they're giving back. I'll make it fit. <laughs> how great is that? We didn't know if Trenton would make it through bone transplant. We were like, if we could just get out of here, we're going to join Cure Childhood Cancer and give back through research so we can get rid of this beastly disease, but also help these families as we see them struggle. Yeah, why don't you go ahead and take that baby? He is okay, and, and he's still on remission, and his cancer has not come back. So we've received the greatest gift of all, and we just want to continue paying that forward. How great is that?